So this is Chippy from uh, midmoves.com at uh, IDF09 and with uh, Limpus here and we're taking a look at some Moblin 2 based uh, distributions that uh, Limpus are working on. Warren Coles is with me, he's going to uh, give me a little bit of information about the, the three systems that we're going to show you. First of all, this is one that will be familiar to people that have been using Moblin 2 Beta. It's pretty much Moblin 2 Beta with Limpus. Uh, Limpus features on it, should we say, yeah? Yeah, what do we call it? We call it a Limpus Mobile Enhanced Edition. Why? What have we enhanced? If you look at the social networks on the right-hand side here, normally there are just eight squares with all the different, the, the four social networks running together. What we've done is give each of the social networks, uh, what is this, Flickr, Face, uh, Twitter, MySpace and Last.fm giving them their own tab so you've got more information and just easier to find it's categorized. We've added a little module down the bottom here which is our webmail module. This has had Gmail, it has Hotmail. Right. And we've also put recent websites here bottom in the middle. Are you making this one available for download or is it purely for uh uh, OEMs to use? No, 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 we'll make it, uh, we're getting ready a download version now, Get, getting it ready so that it, it's available for a uh, more full range of hardware, we'll, we'll put it up in the next couple of weeks. Great, so people with the uh, Acer Aspire can look forward to Olympus, uh, Mobile 2 Olympus download in the next uh, few weeks, that'll be great. So Warren, this is uh, the second one you've got here. This is a little bit more familiar to me. It looks like the old uh, Acer Aspire interface, but uh, is it, it's Moblin 2 underneath, right? Absolutely. This has been fully upgraded, so it is Moblin V2 compliant when the compliance comes out, <laughs> but it, it will be. Uh, and uh, But effectively, we've added clutter into the UI, so what you have some very nice clutter effects when you All right, move across yeah. here. And also we've added preview windows for each of the applications. Yeah. When you hover, yeah. When you hover nice. you'll get the recent for whatever for absolutely every application here on the on the yeah. desktop. Kids oh. save, is that that's a yeah, that's an aspire a, feature, yeah? Yeah, that's a new that's a new application. Yeah. So yeah, it's for you know, so you don't let your kiddies watch the board. Right. <laughs> that's good. Kids safe. Yeah. So is this uh, going to reach um, devices coming from from Acer, or is this just a, a, a little trial bit of software, a little test with you and you guys it's, and Acer? No, it's a fully upgraded version, but whether it hits the shops, it's up to Acer. Right. So this one's actually looking uh, pretty cool. Uh, I don't recognise this at all. Tell us about this one. Yeah, this is the new version of Olympus Linux Lite, generic version. So what we've done here is we've added an application, what we call our live desktop. It's a dashboard style interface, but one where we believe gives you access to much more information than any others around. Uh, what we have here is our favorite websites at the top. What, what, sorry, this should actually be recent websites. So the most recent websites you've opened up are going through here. Your recent objects are thrown through here, your social networks are here, all your information will be coming in from the different social networks. This is your desktop email, uh, your shortcuts, and your webmail again. So, really, absolutely no need to <laughs> open up anything more than the yeah. home page. Right. Also, we've done a couple of extra little things to, because of course, a netbook is small, so we've added some extra thumbnails. Press the little arrow here, and you've got another four behind. That would be really nice with touchscreen support to just be able to flick across. Unfortunately, yeah. there aren't many touchscreen netbooks out there at the moment, but uh, yeah. yeah. And we've added large previews for each of them. Click once to get a big preview. Click again to open the application. Yeah. So doing this sort of uh, variation on the Moblin 2 theme is that a, a difficult task for for Olympus, or is that something that's that Moblin 2 really enables you to do? It enables you to create different UIs very easily, very efficiently, very quickly. Um, absolutely. Uh, for us, Mobilin as a core technology is an excellent technology and the base is the same for, for, the, for both of these three different versions but on top of it we've, added it, we've taken the, what Mobilin sees as the core technology for UI as in Clutter 
and we've integrated it into all of these different desktops. Right. That's great. It's good to see so many, uh, so many tests and experimentation going on here. Looking forward to testing uh, Olympus Lite uh, download in the next few days. So, uh, Warren Coles, thanks very much. Thank you. And uh, good luck. All right.